whenever you invest in a mutual fund there are some cost associated with this mutual fund like you may need to pay a management fund management charges expense ratio transaction fee etc okay this expense ratio can be from 0.7% to 75% to 2.50% of the money that you have invested for an example suppose the expense ratio is 1% for an investment and you invested 1 lakh rupees so you have to pay 100 rupees as expense ratio amount also if you are going to invest in mutual fund for the first time you have to pay rupees 150 as transaction charges and if you are old investor to pay 100 rupees like this it can change actually you can check out with the amcs asset management companies and the mutual fund in which you are investing now investing in mutual fund so there are broadly some steps that you need to follow so first what happened investor they invest their money they give it to amcs in amcs there are fund managers and these fund managers they invest your money in equity government bonds like this and they provide you dividend from the profit that they make and uh, you can also sell out your uh, units and make profit so this is basically what happens in the whole picture of mutual fund investment that you do now after understanding about how do we invest and what happens to the money and all and what is this mutual fund let's look into the types of mutual fund because this is very important so many people heard this word mutual fund but they don't know about the different types of mutual fund schemes that are available